So it's called, I Hope This Is True Love. I saw him at Waterloo Station, platform four with a straight through train. His chiseled chops round the gangsters, eyes shot with short crusted disdain. Disdain, I hear you cry, why disdain? Disdain at his morbid profile. Why was he consuming that? Eat me out, motherfucker. I won't make it fun. <laughs> no words could I utter to his person. I just swooned and lapped him up. Grabbed the latest copy of Joan Collins and zipped me down for a quick imaginary fuck. <laughs> Our eyes met as I encroached his first class carriage, jumping about his massive head. My organs assembling a choral choir, my nipples periodically led. <laughs> we swam all the way home, him and me and me and him together. I galloped, he wandered, I ran. Not my place, obviously, his VW van. <laughs> He fed me up on mashed potato. If I didn't know better, I'd have said it was smash. The texture, the aroma, the feel on my breasts. <laughs> his apparent lack of ready cash. I swallowed down his mashed potatoes from his deep pinked bowl. I mouthed it with my fingers, then my cherried hymen he stole. <laughs> tossed it in his sink. Wrench, wrenching out my throbbing labia, he slowly began to drink. He filled me in and cleaned my wound with his special crusty semen. Pulled back my stiff yellow ribs and knobbed my four chambers region. The man in the moon smiled, my head drooped, imitating a heavy seeded fruit. The eternal winter inside me thawed as from my rancid oyster, fill me come, did shoot. <laughs> so I stepped off him and wrung out my pants. I fingered the text dangles from my sex hair, grabbing a lost quid off the floor, picking the, picking the fragments of pork loin from my teeth. I quietly shut the car door. <laughs>